Hi student. In this part we see about nomenclature of ketone. The general formula for ketone is CnH2n plus 2 CO. Here n started from 2. Why here n started from 2? Because the ketone is different from other functional group. Because it contains two linking sites. These two linking sites must contain at least one carbon to form ketone compound. So, what is the minimum requirement? Here also it needed minimum one carbon atom. Here also it needed minimum one carbon atom. Totally, what is the minimum requirement to form ketone compound is two. So, here it started from that n is equal to started from two. Okay, that naming that name of the alkane deleting that e and add the suffix word one in ketone that suffix word is one next now started that n is equal to 2 general formula cnh2n plus 2 co here we substitute n is equal to 2 okay we get c2 h6 co next is structural formula First, we write the functional group. How we write that? This is the structure of uh, this is the structure of ketone. So, how do we write C double bond O? This is one linking side. This is the another linking side. First, we write the functional group. Next, we move on to the number of carbon atom. How many carbon atom is there? Two. So, here one that another here one. Next to framework. Here this carbon needed 3 more bond to satisfying tetravalency. Here also it needed 3 more bond to satisfying tetravalency. In the central carbon it contains 4. It is surrounded by 4 bonds. Double bond means it contains 2 single bond. Okay. So totally 2, 3, 4. So here that central carbon atom that valency satisfied. Framework now completed. This is the place for hydrogen how many hydrogens are there six one two three four five six okay so this is the first member of ketone family okay so ch3 now condensed formula short form ch3 co ch3 okay naming how many carbon atoms are there one Two, three. That means meth, eth, prop. Okay. The name of the alkane, propane. Okay. Now cancelling that e and add the suffix word one. One for ketone. Okay. Now what we get? Propanone. Okay, so what is the first member of ketone family means the first member of ketone family propanone. Next, see uh, number of carbon atoms 3. Here we substitute n is equal to 3. We get C3 HiCO. Okay, first step to write the functional group. This is the structure of functional group. And next, how many carbon atoms are there? Three. You will, should write one carbon in that one linking site. And the remaining carbon atom filled in another linking site. Okay. So, three carbon atoms are there. So, must I write that one carbon in that side. And remaining carbon atom I placed another linking site. Okay. Now the framework, this carbon contain only one bond, remaining it need three bond. Okay. Next carbon, it surrounded by four bond, the tetravalency completed. So we move on to that next one. It surrounded by two bond, it need two more bond to satisfying tetravalency. And next one, it needed three more bond. Now framework completed. This is the place for hydrogen. How many hydrogens are there? Eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. This is the structure. 
next we converted into condensed form CH3 CH2 CO CH3 okay now naming 1 2 3 4 that means meat eat prop but for alkane butane cancelling e and add one to form butanone okay and next number of carbon atoms four here we substitute that general formula we get the molecular formula c4 h10 co okay first step to write functional group this is the structure of functional group and next four carbon atoms are there you must maintain one carbon in that one linking side and you place the remaining carbon atom and another linking side four carbon atoms are there so i place one carbon atom in that side remaining three carbon atom i place the another linking side okay next to framework it needed three it needed two it needed two it needed three this is the place for hydrogen okay now condensed to form ch3 ch2 ch2 co ch3 naming meth 1 eth prop but pent okay for alkane pentane for uh, functional group ketone so we add o n e as suffix word to form pentanone okay next number of carbon atoms five we substitute the general formula C N H two N plus two C O. We get C five H twelve C O. First, we write that functional group. And next, one carbon. You we keep that one carbon in one linking side. Remaining carbon we place it on that another linking side. So five carbon. I keep that one carbon in this side. Remaining four carbon. I keep it on that another side. Okay. and next uh, framework 3 this carbon is satisfied and it need 2 it also need 2 it also need 3 now that framework completed this is the place for hydrogen 12 hydrogens are there so this is this this place is also 12 next we convert into that condensed form ch3 ch2 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 CO CH3 okay and meth eth prop but pent hex so for alkane hexane if the ketone functional groups present so O N E so hexan known hexanone okay so what is the short way to uh, write the name means root word plus anon okay for example here the prop is root word here we add anon means propanon here the but is root word we add anon means butanon here the root word is pent we add anon means pentanon so in this way in that examination point of view you you easily identify name for example meet eat prop root word is prop and this is the ketone so we add anon ketanone okay so now the naming of the functional group is completed so keep on your mind that ketone is entirely different from other